A Winona State alumni is using his passion for dinosaurs to give back to his alma mater while giving undergraduate students a rare experience. Marie Savage has more. Over 10 years ago, after graduating from Winona State, Adam Schrader began his career as a paleontologist. Beyond his career, he partnered with his professor to give students who are following his path a way to grow and develop. My goal has always been to, to like improve the vertebrate paleontology department of this university. He's bringing the field experience that would normally happen hundreds of miles away right to students on Winona State campus. And we've had um, lots of you know, like Winona State University students actually come out, participate in the digs, do research projects out there. Schrader's work brings him exclusively to the Hell's Creek Formation in southwest North Dakota, which is one of the last places dinosaurs roamed in North America before going extinct. And after over a decade of exploring in the summer of 2024, he and his team discovered a rare fossil. This one was extra special because of the skin and because the tendons were still present in situ around the dorsal processes of the spine. So you also start to get kind of evidence of the musculature along the back. When Schrader came across this specimen, he immediately brought in his old professor, Dr. Lee Beatty, who came in and organized a group of students that would clean the site and preserve it before moving it. We spent our three weeks this season digging it out, um, basically by hand, and put a big plaster jacket over the entire thing built the wooden structure around it, got it hauled out of the Badlands, uh, and then finally it's gotten here. This fossil being at Winona State puts them in rare company, being one of the two universities that house dinosaur mummy material, the other being University of Chicago. It gives undergraduate students the opportunity that most may never see. Typically, if you can imagine being a, a student, no student, no average student is going to get to work on a dinosaur or get to do a research project related to paleontology. And what makes it even more significant is that these are undergraduates getting the opportunity, whereas typically you'd have to have a master's or a PhD to even begin kind of down this road. Opening the door for future paleontologists while leaving his mark on the field. Reporting in Winona, I'm Maurice Savage. And both Schrader and Professor Beatty have already begun extensive research of the fossil. The specimen will eventually go on display to the public.